Yo, yo, what it do, what it do? What's up, guys? I'm back again with another video. Guys, this time I'm going to share with you guys. I picked up today at Walmart. I picked up uh, another professional ball, which I thought was pretty cool. And uh, this one here was $1.97, which is cheaper than the other one that I picked up and shared with you guys. This one right here. Uh, the spray is different and everything. Uh, this one here is uh, all angle. Uh, this one here is a high output spray, but um, uh, this one here actually seems like it's uh, strong, got a strong pump spray to it. But uh, it's called a. I shared this one with you guys before. Y'all remember that one? This one was three dollars. This one was a dollar ninety-seven cents. Both of them is thirty-two ounces. And uh, this is pretty cool. Uh, here it's got the writing, what you, what chemical you want to put in here. And here I have uh, plain water in my eyes right here. Just to test it out. You know, see how she spray or whatever. Uh, it's got a dilution ratio right here on the side, which most of them do. Uh, where you want to dilute it. Four to one, five to one, or whatever, whatever, whatever. One to one, two to one, uh, however you like to do it. Most of my products that I, when I use the greases, and I use them full strength because uh, most of them, um, like let's say I'm using Purple Power or uh, Totally Awesome or something like that, I'm going to use my Totally Awesome is so cheap, dollar a bottle, I feel like you can just use it full screen. You know, I don't really waste no time diluting. I just, if I'm going to pull Totally Awesome in here, I'm just going to fill it all the way up to the brim. I ain't going to dilute it or nothing. I use my stuff full blast. All right? Because I want the full strength of the product. Okay. All right, guys. Now, testing this spray. Let you guys see what it spray like. Here, I'm going to test it out on a, on a, just a scarf or something here. Let you guys now. I'm going to test it out first with the mist. Watch this. See how she mess out? Like that. Okay, and I'm going to flip this scarf over, and we're going to test it out with a screen. Now, you just turn it like this right here, and just test it out for a screen. Uh, longest screen you want, too. It goes pretty far out there. I'm just holding up a scarf here like this. That's how I'm testing it. Now, watch this. See how I should shoot? Watch this guy. See? Puts out a lot of water. That all right, so I just want to test it. Um, let me fold my scarf back up here, let it dry back out. <laughs> Don't want to lay that round down, just let it sit there till it dry back out. Um, yeah, if you um, how do you just just this in? Well, it's a fine mist, and then you just it out like this for more of a screen pattern, like that. Ball is super strong though. I spotted it out today at Walmart. Um, I never really seen these. I didn't think they was quite as expensive as they was. Uh, actually, when I when I picked up this baller right here, this one was actually three dollars. I thought it was a bit pricey, but if you look at those, take a look at them. The baller is actually different check it out see this ball is a little bit taller it has a professional spray on too the spray on this ball is a little bit thicker but this one was three dollars the master blaster wide mouth high output spray was three dollars which i wouldn't pay three dollars for this again as long as i know i got these in there for a dollar and 97 98 somewhere in that neighborhood I'm just gonna buy. I buy these. I pay a dollar and some change for it because it's pretty. It's got a good spray on it, you know. So um, yeah, because a lot of you guys probably was going actually going to Walmart picking up these right here, which you didn't have to. <laughs> I'm glad I found these for you guys because these is much cheaper. Uh, you save yourself by basically a dollar and a little change. Um, this is a good spray though. This is a good one, but uh. You know, Ben, I found this one in there. I'm, I wouldn't buy this one again over this. 
uh, just my word on it. Uh, uh, when I find something cheaper, that's what I run with. You know? <laughs> so yeah, man, this one here is the it's the wide mouth. It's the all angle shrill here. It's a little different. As proud support all works workers with disabilities. Okay, even sprays down upside down, so you can turn the bottle over like this. It's gravity for you too. Let's see what she do here. Let's try it upside down, man. It says gravity feed on side that works. Yeah, it does. See her? See that guy? Sprays upside down. It's gravity free feed. So that's pretty cool right there. Interesting. As you can see right here, it tells you even sprays upside down. See that? That's pretty cool. So for a dollar ninety eight cent, I think that's a pretty big challenge there. Even this one here doesn't do that. This one costs three dollars. It doesn't spray upside down. So uh, yeah, uh, once I find something cheaper, serve the purpose just as good or better. That's why I go with. Y'all know I'm good for bringing you guys something, don't you? <laughs> so I spotted out in that day. I got another one coming up for you guys, man. Uh, I found a professional, another spray bottle, but a small. I'm going to share with you guys. You'd be surprised about this one. Uh, but this one is only like an 8 to 12 ounces or something like that. But still, it's got a professional spray on it. Uh, I'll share it with you guys coming up. But it's pretty cool when this bottle sprays upside down. And I just um, spotted it out. I've seen them before. But what sort of caught my eye is I thought, this one and this one were the same baller until you get them together. I know a lot of you guys see they're not the same baller. You know, if you, you know, just browsing through the store or whatever, you know, you think, oh, you know, basically the same baller. But if you look at them, you can see that the triggers and everything is different. This one got a bigger handle for somebody with larger hands like me. This one here has a smaller handle, which it still works for me. But it's just, you know, not as big. Both of them has a wide mouth, as you can see. But one of them sets up taller. But they're the same ounces. Both of them 32 ounces. But one of them just have a longer neck, too, as you can see. And uh, you can almost tell a big difference in the sprayers. But both of them is considered the professional sprayers, though. See there? So it's a little difference in the sprayers. But, um. Uh, it ain't enough difference in it for me to pay a dollar more, you know. <laughs> so, ain't that much difference in it. Not for me to pay a dollar more, you know. So, got to put it out there like that. And, uh, spray is really well. Um, hit it one more time, man. Watch this. That's your sprays. Now, when you congest it in, you get more of a mist. Like I was telling you guys. Earlier, you get more of a mist like this when you adjust it in. Like this. See that? Come on there. See the mist you get? Get a nice mist here. So that's what you get when you uh, adjust it in. You don't get quite as a wide mouth like, you know, that sharp pattern. When you adjust it in, you get more of a, a wide fan pattern to spray out. But yeah, I know some of you guys probably knew about these. I don't know, but it's an all angle spray. Like I said, it sprays upside down, even like this. You still can use it like a gravity fan and spray it. And uh, still get the job done. That's cool, it sprays upside down. And uh, yeah, check them out in Walmart. This is probably about the cheapest baller you're going to get out of there. Um, for a dollar and ninety seven, ninety eight cents, somewhere like that, it's less than two dollars. And uh, yeah, it's an all angle spray. And uh, this I seen these ballers, but like I said, I was thinking it was the exact same one as the other one that I got until I really looked at them today, and I see that this is a different baller. But this is considered a professional baller, also. When you see sprays like this, this professional stuff. So uh. Yeah, you really could do 
a lot of detail and stuff with these, man. The spreads gonna really hold up. If you got a big fan of professional spreads, which a lot of you guys are, go ahead on, man. Cop that out of Walmart, man. Go uh, hook yourself up. All right, guys, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I just want to share this bottle with you guys, man. Go on to Walmart, pick you up a cup of them. It's actually cheaper than the other one I was telling you guys about this one. This one's $3, which I won't buy this one no more. It's a little bit too pricey. But I don't mind paying a dollar ninety-seven for this one. All right, guys, share me out with your family and friends. And uh, get this bottle. Take care, man. I'll hit y'all on the next one. I'm out of here. Peace.